Hey, this is Rene, and in this quick video, I want to introduce you to the Tesla Trader Expert Advisor. You can see it running in the background already. And the important thing is that this is not a live or a demo account chart or a live trading chart or whatever, but this is the strategy tester. You can see it in the upper left corner. And the problem that many people have is that in the strategy tester, you can do absolutely no manual trading. So you cannot right click, you cannot... Um, modify, open, close, whatever your positions. And this is a big limitation in the MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5. So uh, I wrote a program to get rid of this issue. So there are some limitations still, but this program can help you to test your manual, manual trading strategies in the strategy tester. This is really important because when if you never test your strategies, you will never know if it works in the long run. And the problem with manual strategies is up to this point, you were only able to test it in a real time. So you were only able to test it in a demo or live account, uh, account and do a so-called forward test. But forward tests can be really time consuming and you need at least several weeks or months to figure out if your strategy could be profitable in the long run. So to fix, fix this issue, I created this um, Tesla Trader Expert Advisor and it is a really simple program. You can see we are here right now in the strategy tester and I can use the buttons in the upper left corner to open or close positions and I can also place orders. So let's say, for example, we had this big a movement here which was a strong sell movement or short movement and I can now click on this sell button here which will then create these three lines in the chart. So I could go ahead and simply confirm this order and it would um, open a market position uh, right away but I can also say I want to navigate these orders and let's say I want to navigate this blue line to the low levels here to wait for some kind of retracement before we open a trade and then also I want to say that I want to put the stop loss maybe up here so above the latest high and the TP should be somewhere here. So we are aiming for new lows. Now I can click on confirm here and you can see this will now place a real order in the strategy tester. So yeah, this if this is my strategy, I can do this in the strategy tester as long as I want. And I can also speed the test up a little bit to see if my order is reached by the price and what happens to the order after execution. So you can see here the price is coming back, it barely touched my order and now I can see that my order was executed. This is just like in a live trading chart, it's the same in the tester and now I have this sell position. I can also, if I now click on this number two here, which is another action button, you can see I can still manage this order. So I could click on close, which would close the order immediately. Or I can say maybe the TP should be a little bit further away. So you can see I changed this. So the green TP line is now a little bit below the um, actual TP. And if I click on confirm, it will update the TP here. So watch closely so you can see the program now updates the TP. So you still have full control over your trades um, in the strategy tester. And yeah, you can see this trade is now running. Um, yeah, let me speed this up a little bit. I didn't test this before, so I don't know if this will be a winning or a losing trade, but um, yeah, I can speed this up um, as much as I want. And at some point we can see this time it was a winning trade. So now we have our first winning trade, order is closed, everything is back to normal, so to say, and um, we could go for more trades. But first of all, let us have a look at the settings again. So uh, especially at the inputs. So right now we only have three inputs, which are really self uh, explaining. So the first one is the lots. So every position or order will be placed with 0 0.5, 0 0.1, 0 0.2, whatever I type here, lots. Then we have the small step points and the big step points. And you probably saw before, when I modified the entry uh, point for our order or position and the TP and stop loss levels, I always use these plus, minus, plus, plus, minus, minus buttons in the chart. And we can define by how much 
the um, the price is moved for, for the lines in the chart if one of these buttons is pressed. So I could say, for example, the small step point should still be one, but the big step point should maybe be 100 instead of 50 because we are trading in the one hour chart. So if I start another quick test, we will now see that whenever I click on the plus plus, it will move the lines by 100 instead of 50 like it did before. So let's not uh, do the same trade. Maybe we have another uh, trading scenario here. So let's say this is a uh, solid buy trend. I will not do a in-depth analysis here. This is just to show you how the program works. And I can say I want to open a buy position, maybe also a buy, um, a market buy position. And I just want to uh, hit the last lows up here. So yeah, maybe maybe a little bit more for the TP. Let's uh, say like 100 points more. And you can see this should be now about 100 points that I just moved the line by clicking on the plus. Uh, also, I want to have the stop loss maybe down here and move it a little bit up using this plus. And then, yeah, if I just click on confirm, it will open a market position. And this time it will open a market position because I did not change the entry price. So whenever you keep the entry price as it is, uh, when you click on buy or sell, it will open a market position. So if I click on confirm, you can see we directly open this market position. I could go ahead and place another buy limit order maybe by saying if the price comes back into the range here, I want to place a buy limit order here and maybe I want to have the stop loss on the same level and the TP also on the same level as uh, for the first trade. So I just have to rearrange these lines. And then if I click on confirm, you can see the button for order number three has a slightly different color because this is a order and not a position. So yeah, this is great. Also, we can not only place market or limit orders. We can also say if everything goes wrong, I want to have a sell stop order here maybe. So you can see, uh, you can do all kinds of stuff like the same things pretty much that you could do in live trading. And for this sell stop order, I want to have ATP, I don't know, maybe here and the stop loss should be above these highs. If I click on confirm, we now have this sell stop order. And now I can speed this up as much as I want. Um, yeah, I can of course increase the speed and decrease the speed. And this is a huge benefit that we have in the strategy tester because um, this is something that helps us to test our manual strategies like really in a really efficient way, really quickly, because we can also do it on historical data and we do not only have to rely on a forward test, which can take several weeks or months. Also, which is really important is you could, of course, go ahead and just analyze the historical movements in the chart. But let me pause the test quickly here. But the big problem is if you are honest with yourself and if you try to trade a historical chart like this by seeing everything, are you really doing it without any influence of the following prices? Because if you, for example, see this part of the chart and you also see the next part of the chart, it will have an influence on your decisions, of course you might find excuses why a trade is bad or you might find, find reasons why a trade is good just because you see the following chart pattern and you know it would be a winning or losing trade. But this is not the case in the strategy tester. Here you really have to trade what you see. So this is as close as it gets to a real life trading scenario. So you cannot trick yourself and this is so important and this is why this tool is so powerful and I think every manual trader should really make use of this. So we can see now the buy limit order was reached barely and now we are just waiting for the uh, trade to either hit the TPs or the stop loss and uh, yeah, I can fast forward this a little bit more. And yeah, you can see I'm trading multiple days here in a matter of seconds or minutes. Um, and this is something that would take 
it would take you a while if you would trade this in a real account. So now we, um, yeah, we saw these two orders hit the TP actually. And I might say something like, oh, this sell stop order, I don't need it anymore. So I can click on this four here, which is the order number of the order. And I can, uh, I, I mean, I need this button because I cannot right click and cancel this because this is the, uh, the strategy tester. Manual trading is not allowed. So I have to click here and I can click on delete and the order is gone. So you can see this is uh, the power of this tool. Currently it features market buy and sell orders, um, buy stop, buy limit, sell stop, sell limit orders. So all the order types that you normally have in uh, trading the meter trader. Also, we have uh, like, for example, if I just open multiple uh, positions here, we can, um, yeah, let me just open a bunch of positions here. And if I click the close delete all button, all of these positions will be gone with the next tick. Oh, and this is also an important uh, thing. Everything, like every button click is processed or the button clicks here are pro processed on the next tick. So if you click a button, it will enter the clicked mode, so to say. And with the next tick, we will see the uh, operational panel here. This is necessary because in the MetaTrader 5 tester, there is no other way. You can only do it like this because chart events, like a normal button click, is not processed in the MetaTrader tester. This is why you always have to wait for the next tick in order to see the yeah, operation panel here popping up. And same is for the cancel and confirm and everything. Um, so yeah, this is important. Um, also you saw we can open as many positions as we like and we can close and delete all of them with just one button click. And yeah, you can see right now I made a profit of 700 USD and now it's up to you if you want to use this program for your own testing of your own manual strategies and see if it could be profitable in the last one or two years because if not, why would you, trade, why would you want to trade it in a live trading account? So this tool can help you save so much money and so much time. I hope you liked it. Um, yeah, feel free to use it and let me know what you think about it. Thanks for watching. Have a great time. Good trades. Bye.